Hello everyone, it is I, the Chosen One, with the divine right to tell you the gospel. We're gonna, we're gonna talk about deathbed. You know what deathbed is when, you, when you're when you like about to die, and you're like sitting or laying down, sitting, <laughs> laying down, your family's over you, and you're like, I right, get your final words out. There are some people who have gotten deathbed conversion. They're like about to die, and they're like, I accept Jesus into my heart. And then boom, they're good, they're done. Good job. I feel like that's not how it works, but just, just shh, okay, just let people believe what they want to. <laughs> I feel really bad. And it feels really disgusting when I hear stuff like that. The kind of hypocrisy, you know what I mean? That look, some people believe that that you have to be baptized in this church or going to hell. But who's to say which church to get baptized in? Who's to say you have to be baptized? I mean, I doubt highly that people who have deathbed conversions get baptized. Does baptism even matter at that point? Is, does it just not count? Is that rule just thrown out? And what about those who've been like complete assholes their entire life? Sinners, just, and they have a deathbed conversion, so now they're in heaven? What kind of crap is that? A lot of religions say that I'm going to go to hell. And, well, I know for a fact that I'm not going to have a deathbed conversion. Because that's cop-out. I'm an atheist. I'm going to go full out. I'm not just going to have a deathbed conversion. Because, oh, well, you know, he maybe exists. So deathbed conversion. No, fuck that. Because who knows? Maybe I get converted to the wrong religion. And God's even more mad. It's like, you had a deathbed conversion? And it was the wrong religion. He just fucking slaps me in the face. No. <laughs> but yeah, and it's it's just, it's it's really a shame when people have deathbed conversions. It's it's manipulation. <laughs> They're weak and vulnerable. They're about to die and they don't want to die. Most of the people who are about to die don't want to die. That's just a fact. You're like, hey, you don't have to die. You can go to heaven. Just have a conversion right here. I can do it for you. Just accept Jesus into your heart and you're good. It is. It's just straight up manipulation. You're manipulating somebody into joining your religion right after they die. And then you can feel good to yourself. Like, oh yeah, I sent that person to heaven. You're like, hallelujah. Ugh. You know how fucking sad it would be if I'm like on my f deathbed and I'm thinking I'm going to go to heaven. And then I die and then I'm just, it's just eternal darkness. That's fucking sad. And I know that I won't be feeling anything because after all, it is just eternal darkness. It's not like I'm going to have emotions when I'm, when I'm dead. <laughs> but at the same time, it's so sad. It's just like, wow, this is. It's like somebody daring somebody to ask somebody out. It's like if I dared Sarah to ask Jim out. And Sarah's like, okay, hey, Jim, you want to go out? And Jim's like, sure, I'll go out with you. And Sarah's like, ha, I got you, bitch. Poor Jim. Jim didn't deserve that. But you get what I'm trying to say. It's like a practical joke. It's a prank. Ha, you're actually not going to go to heaven. It's just eternal darkness pranked. It does really upset me to think that some people are going to die with false hope. It's like watching somebody who's like trying to survive cancer is living through and then he's like, I'm going to make it. I'm going to go through. I'm going to finish this cancer and this cancer will not get me. And then sure enough, cancer does. Sometimes it, it, it's just that way. And it's sad to see somebody so determined with so much hope to die. And that's why deathbed conversions upset me. That's why dying and being religious upsets me in the first place. Because there, there's no heaven. There's no hell either. And I wholeheartedly believe that. I do believe, with the benefit of the doubt, there's no heaven or hell. I do really believe that. So when people do believe in heaven and do believe in hell, and they're like, I'm going to go to heaven, and they don't. I really wish there was a way to communicate with people who have died. I, It would just solve everybody's fucking problems <laughs> but that's impossible because they're dead now i'm just sad thanks a lot but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know what do you what do you guys think about this you think it's extremely upsetting and sad when somebody dies thinking they're gonna go to heaven but at the same time it's always nice to remember those people as you know they're happy and they're and they're good and, and they and they died happy so is it really that sad maybe hope you guys enjoyed the video please like we did and yeah that's Pretty much it. Bye bye.